One Chicago Preview What to Watch for in April 15's Season Finals Onechikavacenter.com slash 2020 slash 4 twelfths slash 1 Chicago Preview April 15, 2020 What's Coming in the Next Chicago Fire, Chicago PD and Chicago Med Episodes Find out what to watch for in our One Chicago Preview for April 15. Fans are already looking forward to the next Chicago PD, Chicago Med and Chicago Fire episodes, so what should you be looking forward for? What clues can we pick up from the promos we've seen this week? Get your first glimpse ahead in our One Chicago Preview. The week of April 15 is also season final week. Due to the coronavirus pandemic, and the subsequent production shutdown. The One Chicago series were unable to finish their seasons and thus will be calling it quits with their 20th episodes. The synopsis for the Chicago Fire season finale says that Emily Foster, Annie Alonze, will contemplate a big decision. What does that mean? And haven't we seen this story before? Only one Foster-related thing was hinted at last week, and that was Dr. Will Halstead, Nick Gelfus, telling her that she might have missed her calling after she performed a risky surgical procedure. But that's very close to her dilemma at the end of last season, when Foster was offered the chance to return to medical school, only to turn it down in favor of staying at Firehouse 51. Is the show going to go down that road again? Especially since it would only seem to have one possible ending given that there's no expectation that Alonze would leave the show. Or is there something else that's going to pop up for Emily in this episode? Like how her partner's birth mother unexpectedly resurfaced earlier this season. Watch the promo for Chicago Police, Season 7, Episode 20. Wednesday's Chicago PD episode involves Kevin Atwater, Leroyce Hawkins, coming face-to-face with the racist cop, who previously crossed the line with him during night in Chicago. Adwater already gave him a piece of his mind before, but the next time around, will he completely lose it? It takes a lot to push the normally level-headed Adwater over the edge, but one Chicago viewers have seen that it's possible. Will he do something he regrets? Could we see him on the hot seat again? Or will this be another story about the intelligence unit Bending the rules in order to make sure someone else gets what they deserve, if nothing else. This means a lot of screen time for the usually underutilized Leroy's Hawkins, and that is always a positive. Toy's subsequent near death encounter at Chicago Medical. During A Needle in the Heart, Dr. Ethan Choa, Brian T., will put his life in danger to save a child. That would make Wednesday the second time in two seasons that Choi is at risk of being killed off, the prior one being the poison inside use. That's not the surprising part, as Chicago Med has routinely put its doctors into plots where they have to save their own skin. The question is what the show will do with this story. More than once, the writers have used a traumatic event as the inciting incident that makes a bickering couple forget their problems and reconcile. See, Manstead after Natalie's helicopter crash, and Connor and Ava after she passed out in the hybrid or Choi broke things off with April Sexton, Yaya da Costa, at the end of the latest episode. But will April's fear for Choi's life cause them to have an emotional reunion? and get back together for what would be the third time? We'll have to watch and see if Chexton's feelings read night when things get tough. For the latest Chicago Med Season 5 spoilers and news, plus more on the entire series, follow the Chicago Med category at One Chicago Center. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to our Chicago Pete official channel and stay with us.